Hey, welcome back to Homegrown Country Homestead. How y'all doing? Well, today we're going to make this little short video about our uh, tomato soakers. We cut off our uh, brandy wine tomatoes uh, probably about 10 days ago, and we uh, put them in the water there. And uh, I'm going to show you the root system on it, how it turned out. And uh, me and Austin, we're going to get these planted today, and, and it's going to give us the opportunity to have a um, tomatoes later in the season. And uh, let me show you what these roots right here looks like. You see all the roots that um, came out on the stem of the tomato. Uh, that's that's going to root real good, and like I say, it's real easy. Um, all you have to do is just like, cut it, cut the um, the sucker off, and uh, just stick them in the water. And uh, one thing I did observe though, and uh, something that you know um, I'm not going to do anymore, just because I can see it doesn't work as well. Uh, if you look right here where I took my knife and scraped the uh, uh, stem of the tomato if you look the roots right here they're not uh, there's not as many roots on the uh, stem but if you look where I didn't scrape look how many more roots it is so there there's something to be learned with that you know uh, I've done it both ways before but uh also, I can see right here, and I want to show y'all that, that by just cutting uh, the sucker from the tomato plant and sticking it into the water, that's going to be your best way to go. And uh, uh, don't, don't, don't scrape it. And uh, I told y'all in the last video that where I cut the uh, uh, suckers off my tomato plants, you know, I take a knife, scrape it. And um, obviously, you know, the, the difference is a huge right there. So I won't be doing that anymore. Um, so we're going to go ahead and let uh, Austin uh, set these plants out, and he's going to put some water in there with them. And I've got my Epsom salt and fertilizer in there with my uh, mixed in with my dirt there. So uh, let me uh, let him go ahead and get started on this. Here you go, son. Go ahead and start putting them in each mound. Yeah, you start in that first one right there. Mm -hmm. Put it in there, baby. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, let go of it. Now come over here and get these other ones and put one in each mound. Yeah, just pick your handful of them up and put one in each one. Let me help you out there. There you go. Alright, just lay it, lay it down. Put you one right there in this one. He, he he's being careful not to uh, damage your nature, boy. You ain't got, you're not going to hurt them. Go ahead and pick them up and put the rest of them in there. You're not going to hurt them. Go ahead. Yeah, that's the next one. Okay, lay it down. Just drop it. Drop it. Don't, don't worry about it. It's not going to hurt it, baby. Get the other two right there. Pick both of them up. Pick this one up here, too. Take with you. So you can drop one in each one. One inch hole. Go ahead. Yeah, right there. Okay, now put your other one in the other mound. That's good. Okay, drop it in there. Okay, now now put some water. Right here, this bucket. Got a cup in there. And put you some water in each mound. Start with your first one up yonder.
There you go. You can leave it. Just pour it in there. And then put some more in there. Okay, put another cup in there. And that helps out in uh, putting that water in there. helps that uh, plant from having so much shock and uh, we'll go through here and we'll we'll put water probably about three cups or so in it and let it uh, soak in and uh, we'll probably come back before we push the dirt in around the plant probably put another cup or so in there so uh, we're gonna go ahead and let Austin finish doing this and uh, we'll be back tell him we'll be back Austin Good job, Austin. You're doing good, boy. Push that dirt up around it. And smooth it out now. You're learning, ain't you? Doing a good job. All right, the next thing we're going to do, we're right here, this uh, gum tree right here. Actually, it's a gum bush. Uh, it's a gum tree I cut down, and it's kind of uh, bushed out, trying some grow again, some new growth. But um, what we're going to do here is... Uh, cut some of these uh, limbs off and we're going to shade our new tomato plants so at hot sun uh, it's been getting well up in the 90s and uh, we're going to shade the tomato plants so they can take hold uh, and hopefully they'll make it you know hold that camera there Bubba Like helping daddy. Cece, she's in bed asleep, ain't she? She's a sleepy head, ain't she? One day Austin, he'll remember how we cut these uh, gum limbs and he'll probably shade his tomatoes the same way. Push it down in there. All right. Put you some more around it on the other side. Right here, put them around the plant right there. The same plant, put it on the other side of the tomato plant. No, baby, right here. You gotta put it right here on this other side. You wanna shade all the tomato plant. Take it and push in like that. Okay, now put one right here on the side. Right there. Push it down in there good. All right. All right. Well, tell everybody what you just did. Do you know what you just did? What did you do? 
you put some gum plants around the tomato plant, didn't you? Do you know what that does to the plant? Help it does? You're not really sure? You, you know what it's for? What is it for? Helps to shade the tomato plant, don't it? Helps them get a good start. Well, you learning, ain't you, son? Well, you want to tell everybody, see you later? See you later? Tell everybody, appreciate you watching. And tell everybody, have a good day. And say, have a blessed day. All right. I appreciate y'all watching. And uh, we got a show you right here. We got these shaded and got a few more right here we got to do. And uh, Austin, I believe he's uh, learning. And I'm, I'm happy to uh, be out here getting to show him this. And I know one day he'll, he'll plant his garden and he'll probably do the same thing. And that's what it's all about, you know, getting out showing you kids how to do things and um, getting them out of the house and uh, enjoy getting out here working with them. So, as always, from our family to yours, y'all have a blessed day, friends. See y'all later. Bye-bye. <laughs>